Okay, so we're going to do the zodiac sign cancer. And this could be you who went through this. This could be someone that you're attached to, someone that you have detached from. This could be someone who wants to come towards you, different people that they're attached to, different people that they have detached from. This is masculine and feminine energy, past, present, or near future. So you have to take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Okay, so what do we have for the zodiac sign cancer? So we have the justice. So this is some type of balance coming in um, for a situation. Two of Wands is here. You could have been at a stalemate or somebody wanted you to be at a stalemate, you know, not knowing which direction to take. And um, justice is being served for you. Something is being balanced out. And then page of wands in the reverse. Yeah, somebody don't know what to do. It's like with this two of wands and page of wands in the reverse, this is not good news for someone that a situation is being balanced out for you. So this could be the person that wanted you to be at a stalemate, not knowing which direction to take, wanting you to just... Um, like prolong, like they were trying to prolong some type of movement. They wanted something to be at a standstill. Like they wanted to just, yeah, they wanted you to have bad luck. The will of fortune in the reverse. This was somebody that was trying to stop destiny. So if they wanted you to be at a stalemate and they did something to try to have you to be at a stalemate, they're receiving bad luck. They don't, you know, like the fact that justice is uh, still coming in for you. Yeah, they're confused. Seven of Cups is here. This person was trying to place illusions or doing a lot of stuff to confuse. Uh, could have been around you or other people. Three of Pentacles is here. <laughs> Yeah, it's like they could have been working with different people, partnering up with different people to cause confusion. And now they're standing at a stalemate. They don't know what to do. They're receiving bad luck for whatever they did to cause this confusion. And justice is still coming in for you. Yeah, it's like somebody did not want something to end out. The death card in the reverse. So they got behind the scenes and, you know, collaborated with different people, partnered up with different people to try to cause some type of illusion. And it didn't work. Yeah, Ten of Swords is here. And then Eight of Cups. So, yeah, it's like somebody feel betrayed. And they're walking away from whatever illusion and confusion that they were in. So, whoever partnered up with this person, they could have placed an illusion around them to get them to partner up with them, collaborate against, you know, with them against you. And they're finding out that they were betrayed. I'm so done. This is sad. Eight of Wands is here. And then Queen of Swords is here. Nine of Cups. Yeah, and somebody is not, you know, happy that you're happy. You're at the Nine of Cups, wish fulfillment, content. Yeah, and it's like, <laughs> you could have went through a lot of betrayal, and it was a lot of confusion being done so you could be at a stalemate. But you're at the Eight of Cups. It's like you, you're walking away, and justice is coming in for you. A lot of stuff have come in quick for you. Eight of Wands, Queen of Swords is here. Whatever was done to you could have been something that was, you know, injustice to you. They could have tried to prolong something in the justice system if you were um, betrayed some type of way in the justice system. But it's like you fought hard. Queen of Swords is here. You remain happy. You remain in this Nine of Cups energy. 
And a lot of people were behind the scenes confused. Like different people that were collaborating with this person. And it's like now bad luck is around these people and they feel betrayed. It's like they're walking away from this person. Yeah, they were lied to. Two of swords is here. It's like they lied to different people and confused them, placed an illusion around them to get them to do, you know, whatever it is they wanted them to do to help them. This is sad. Yeah, they're under judgment. It's like they lied to that person or to these people. Now they're under judgment. Different people walked into a situation blinded, you know, believing a lie. They're under judgment. If they were helping that person cause betrayal. The Herman is here. And then Six of Pentacles is here. So the Hermit and Six of Pentacles, this is like equal give and take. So somebody could have ghosted somebody. It's like if somebody ghosted you, the Hermit is here, or this could be you in Hermit mode. But with the Six of Pentacles and the Hermit, it, this is like somebody could have ghosted you or they wanted this somebody to distance themselves from you and this is why they lied. It's like now that is coming back on that person. Because the people that they lied to or the person that they lied to, they realized they were betrayed. They were confused. Yeah, temperance in the reverse. It could be somebody that's very angry. Ten of Pentacles is here. Yeah, this person could have promised people a whole bunch of money or something like that. They thought this person would have a lot, you know, gain a lot. But this person had placed an illusion around these people. It's like they're at the will of fortune in the reverse. They don't have any good luck. They have bad luck. Oh, I'm so <laughs> This is not okay. The, the hair fine is here. Yeah, somebody is pissed off. It's like they're angry. You could be in this Ten of Pentacles hair fine energy. This person thought that they would, you know, go to, going to spread some type of lie. They were trying to stop destiny. This person could have thought they would stop your destiny, your purpose. And they're pissed off and mad because you're still in this energy. This person did not realize they could not stop anything that was destined for you. Anything that God wanted you to have. It's like God had to step in on this situation and was protecting you the entire time. And this person was in some type of seven of cup illusion and a confusion. And other people that were attached to them, they were blinded from the truth. Ace of Wands and then Ten of Cups is here. Yeah, this is something serious. I'm so done. This person could have promised a whole bunch of people a new beginning. They were going to start over. They were going to have a whole bunch of money or something like that. Yeah, I'm so done. The devil. This person is somebody that's obsessed. Like they're addicted. They're, they're toxic. This could be a group of people. You know, they were thinking that they were getting ready to start over. They would have this Ten of Pentacles. This person was promising them a whole bunch of stuff that they weren't going to get. It's like this person placed an illusion around them and other people. And, you know, made their self believe that they were going to be able to stop your destiny and then walk in it. I'm so done. Yeah, and it's like they're in this hangman energy. The hangman and then the devil. It's like they're, they owe debts to the devil and they're stuck. A whole bunch of people. They didn't know this person was here to rile up a bunch of people for the devil. To have them stuck. I'm so done. I'm so done. These are, I'm so done. Everybody is learning lessons. That's why, you know, these people that were partnering up or collaborating with this person is under judgment as well. Yeah, Tower. It's like now they're realizing that they're stuck. Now they're realizing that they could not stop your destiny. They're realizing that this person lied and only, um, you know, surrounded bad luck around them.
Yeah, it's like they're realizing this now. The sun card is here. They're seeing things for what it is. A lot of stuff is being illuminated to these people. While justice is being served for you after this person lied on you. And they're under judgment. Yeah, the star card is here. A lot of people are looking at you in the sun card energy and the star card uh, energy. These are people that see you as someone that is uh, spiritually woke. You're a spiritual teacher, a healer, um, someone that is very balanced out and grounded. You're also someone that's spiritually protected. And whatever this person was doing to, you know, try to confuse you or confuse your energy, it backfired. It caused something to be ended out. The world is here. Yeah, it's like these people see you as the star. And they see this person as someone that's the devil. Three of Wands is here. And then Five of Pentacles. Yeah, it's like somebody ended something out and they've made a final decision to um, leave this person out in the cold. This is sad. It's like you release this, but this person is not stable like mentally. It's like they place illusions around their self. Everything backfires. Seven of Wands is here because you're divinely protected. Your energy field is blocked off. Your energy field is guarded. Nine of Wands is here, but this was hidden. That person did not know. Yeah, this person did not know. It's like they were just confusing their self and the people that they were attached to. Whatever, the, whatever you do come back on you and the people that you're attached to. I'm so done. Four of Swords is here. It's like this situation has been laid to rest. Three of Cups is here. We could be celebrating or getting ready to celebrate something. Three of Cups and then the Chariot is here. It's like you've moved on. You've moved forward. You're getting ready to, you know, as I keep hearing, celebrate. King of Swords is here. And then the Emperor is here. I'm so done. Wow. And then five of swords is here. Somebody feels sad, like they sabotaged themselves. This could have been somebody that distanced themselves from you with this king of swords. This could have been a person that they wanted to ghost you or they this person ghosted you and they didn't want this person to communicate with you and they were, you know, placing illusions and lying. This person is not happy that um, you're moving forward. It's like they feel defeated. Whoever this emperor is. This person is in this king of swords energy. They're very detached and distant. Yeah, queen of cups is here. This could have been somebody that you were showing love to, being genuine to. And three of swords in the reverse. Yeah, it's like you're not heartbroken. You're not depressed. Yeah, because you knew the truth the entire time. It's like you already gained truth and clarity. You already knew the truth about something. So whatever was being done, it's like you could have been this person in this high priestess energy. You already knew that people were trying to place an illusion around you. They were spreading lies on you. You could have spoke the truth and then all of this happened behind the scenes. Other people probably did not know and now they're realizing whatever you spoke the truth about was true. This is why you were never depressed or heartbroken. It's like you hadn't spoke truth and clarity and then you hadn't got on the chariot. You already knew the outcome. You knew that everything would backfire. And it's like this person feel defeated. Knight of Wands is here. Knight of Cups and then Nine of Pentacles is here. This, this is two different people. Knight of Cups, Knight of Wands, Nine of Pentacles. So you could be in this energy where you're single and it's two different people trying to come towards you to um, connect with you or something like that. Wow, Knight of Swords is here. 
It's multiple people. These are people that literally could have sat back and just sabotaged yourself um, under some type of illusion and a confusion. Queen of Wands is here. These are people that are attracted to you. And then the Strength card is here. So it's like one person wants to connect with the United Cups, whoever these three people are. Knight of Wands is here. Somebody um, could have been behind the scenes wanting to, you know, have sex with you. They wanted you to be attracted to them. This is somebody that's attracted to you. But this Knight of Swords energy could be the person that lied. Like they're pissed off. Wow. It's like whatever. It's like. Whatever they did, whatever they, you know, said, whatever they lied about, it has people like you're attracting a lot of attention. This didn't do nothing but make um, somebody more attracted to you with the strength card and queen of wands or different people, whatever they lied about. And they pissed off. Knight of Swords is here. It's like they ran in quick and said something too quick or did something. You know, too quick to create some type of illusion behind the scenes. And it did not work to people, to people that were watching you. So they could have knew that these people were watching you, attracted to you, or something like that. They did not expect this outcome. King of Pentacles is here. The Fool card and then Two of Cups. So somebody wants to come towards you, whoever this King of Pentacles is. They want to partner up with you. It's like this person is going towards a whole nother direction. Page of Cups is here. This, could, this is someone that's a secret admirer, Page of Cups. The Lovers in the Reverse. And then four cups is here. And then page of swords. Wow. So with this lovers popped out in the reverse, it's like somebody was watching. As I said, this is multiple people were watching you. This person was one of the people that were watching you and they were secretly admiring you. It's like they, five of swords is here. These are people that could have literally like been in conflict with each other or um, like trying to sabotage each other. So, you know, that person would not come towards you or that person would not come towards you. Multiple people or it could have been two different people. And then Six of Wands is here. Yeah. So somebody literally thought that once somebody came towards you, this could be someone that um, you have a spiritual connection with, with the lovers popping out in the reverse and Four of Cups. They wanted that person to reject you because they didn't want this person to uh, connect with you because you have a spiritual connection with that person. And it's like they're watching you as you're at the Six of Wands having victory. They could have thought once this person came towards you, that's when you'll have victory. You'll um, be held in high honor or something like that. Or you don't have your Ten of Pentacles. Oh, excuse me. But it's like you moved on. You already knew truth and clarity. You're in this Queen of Swords energy. It's like your Ten of Pentacles was protected the entire time. Somebody that did this, they're very small-minded, very immature. That's why they did something so quick. It's like they heard something, they didn't like it, and they just ran quick and started, you know, clucking around and doing a whole bunch of stuff without thinking. Yeah, and it's like you're at the Six of Wands having victory and success by yourself. You don't need this person. This could have been somebody who needed that person or wanted that person for whatever they can give them, King of Pentacles. 
I'm so done. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles on the bottom of the deck. It's like they wanted that person to give to them. Now they're unhappy. Because you're at the Six of Wands having victory and success. Yeah, while they're at the Ten of Wands, way down, pressured, and burdened. It's like somebody picked up a lot of burdens and they're weighed down. Trying to carry all of this baggage and burdens that they had them picked up. I'm so dumb. This is sad. And with least expect whatever they were trying to do to you, they were doing it to their self. <laughs> make it make sense. Yeah, Empress in the reverse. This is somebody that thought they were going to have some type of control over your destiny, your purpose. This person is somebody that don't even have control over their self. This person is not stable all around the board. And I'm, I'm so done. <laughs> I'm hearing the need to go get help. Wow. Yeah, four wands in the reverse and then the empress in the reverse. This person is unstable. They don't have any stability and they were trying to, you know, secretly try to have some type of control over you by spreading lies, confusion, negativity. And pissed off because justice is being served for you, but you already knew the outcome. They didn't know the truth. They were placing this illusion around their self and blinding their self from the truth. As they were blinded, playing with stuff they know nothing about. Yeah, it's like they slowed their self down, distracted their self. Other people are realizing they were slowed down. They were distracted. Knight of Pentacles. Ace of Cups is here. Yeah, they were trying to slow somebody down that um have emotions for you or they want to express their emotions to you. The Musician is here. Yeah, because they thought that if this person came towards you, you and this person would be in this musician energy. You're by yourself in this musician energy. You have a cup, you have a pinnacle, you have a wine, you have a sword. You're manifesting whatever it is that you want out of life. Because you have control of your own life. You're the musician of your own life. This person did not know because they don't have control of their own life. They're binded and blinded and stuck and tied up to the devil for a lot of bad karmic debt that's owed. As they chose to walk in devil energy and not their own. 